Dr. K is about to see a lovebird with a large mass on its neck, which was diagnosed by another vet as cancer. I've had Atlanta for about five years. Uh, she's got lymphosarcoma. The vet said that the reason why the tumor is growing is because the jugular is wrapped around the tumor, and that's what's feeding it all its nutrients and why it's growing so fast. We've had two surgeries already to remove it, and the growth has come back, and I'm here for a second opinion on it. It's OK, I'm here. Where's this little angel? Are you in there trying to fly away? No, she's scared. lamma has been through a lot. Yeah, she has. When did this all start? I noticed a growth starting in late 2012. OK, so this has been going on a while. We're in, oh, yeah. Gotcha, OK. Oh, yeah. poor little thing. Hey, look, I'm going to I know, it's OK. <laughs> She's a female lovebird. She's got sass. That's good. You need sass to live through something like this. Hey, Stinkerbell, what you doing, honey? <laughs> Atlanta. Well, she had a sister. The sister was Georgia. <laughs> That's a big old lump there, little mama. And how long is it? It's always been this big? Do you have pictures? No, of... it, it keeps just growing every day. I understand. <laughs> Even it's though we're doing the, day, the weekly chemo, it's still yeah. growing. I want to take x-rays today okay. and see what's going on, and then run some in-house blood work and see what her organ function is. OK. Sounds like a tough little cookie, though. You want to fly around for a little bit? I don't mind. Run, 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 run. Come on, you're free. Run, 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 run. run. That would probably be analogous to you or I having a basketball on our neck. Okay. I'll put her under anesthesia for x-rays. I'm going to put a teeny tiny needle in there, suck a couple cells out, put them on a microscope slide. They okay. dry. I stain them. They dry. And then I read them out. And then we can potentially even plan a surgery. Because ideally with tumors, what we like to do is debulk them first mm -hmm. and then do chemo. It'll be OK, honey. Yeah, she's delicate, though. So we're going we're gonna to just do one little thing at a time. I'm not ready to give up yet. Me neither. That's why we're here. She appears to be a pretty sound bird, so I'm hoping we can give her some relief from this, this big mass on the side of her neck. Take good care of her. I will, honey. It's going to be OK. Oh, it's going to be all right. Oh, it's going to be all right. OK. She's only going to be here for a couple hours today. And then uh, once everything's back, all the blood work and samples that she's taken, uh, we'll go and see if surgery is the best option, which probably it will be.